Welcome back, everyone, to another Oblivion House Hunter. Uh, this one is... Uh, well, I'm kind of excited for this one. Uh, it's going to be an alien home, which is not an alien ruin. Uh, if you can't tell, I'm rather a, a big fan of aliens. My race is currently alien, my armor is alien, and my weapons are alien. So maybe this character can find a home. Uh, we're gonna run there because I like to see a house for the first time f from the distance. Best way to really get a ooh factor. So let's go. Not what I was hoping to see. Maybe I installed it wrong. Let's try again. Alright, I got that figured out. I'm not exactly sure what I did, but it works, so now let's go finally take a look. It is certainly pleasing to the eye from a distance, but up close all the shine is, uh, it's a little too much. Maybe it's just because I have everything blasted on the computer. But, yeah. Let's keep looking. That's a problem. Wow. Very impressive. Right off the bat, things to uh, display. Now this is new. They fixed it so you can actually store things. You can actually, you know, display them and hang them up and stuff like that. That is good because the original Vanilla versions of these things are, uh, how do you say, pain in the asses. I take it you want something. Well, what is it? I'm not gonna even touch that. Yeah, and still, like more sword wall hanger things. Put like a helmet on this thing. Welcome. Uh, bow hangers or sword, you can put them sideways, I'm guessing. Very nice. I am very impressed already, and this is just the start. So now I can just, from anywhere I guess, just teleport directly to the, to the castle. Uh, that I like, because I don't like to travel. So if I want to go some, somewhere, well, to my house, bam, instant. I like that. I'll take it. 
if I choose to keep the house. So everything is labeled, so you can sort, and uh, of course if you sort things, you'll, you you tend to know where you put them, but it's rather nice to actually have them labeled. Wow, everything is labeled. So many display things, it's it's just amazing, I love it. I don't think there's even enough weapons to put all these things on. Look at this one! Wow. Swimming pool. I like it. I like the, all the Welkin stones just glowing under the water. It is so nice looking. It's got a nice little waterfall going into it. Nice screenshot turned into a painting. Now from the description, these cupboards are the only containers not safe. So just no storage in here. Peasant quarters. Look at the muscles on you. Oh thank you, alien woman. Can't walk through that. There we go. Very nice. I'd make that walk throughable just because. My bedroom. Very nice, just brings you everywhere. I'll have to remember that.
Nice. I, l I love this. Brings you to any house you own. Uh, would make it very useful if you say you own Rose Thorn Hall and that's where all your current stuff is. Then you can just go right there and then use the necklace and come right back. None of my stuff is in those houses though, so I'll have to do it the hard way. Alright, let's use the necklace and teleport around. To... Training room. So I might have just screwed myself, because now I can't get out. Never mind. That was fun. <laughs> Alright, so it just sets you up with a fight, so that's kind of cool. You know what's funny? I didn't even think about using these to display staves. And I collect staves. So, yeah. These are even better than I thought they were. Black Soul Gem Altar, very nice. Okay. Small indoor garden. The Philosopher's Stone. Uh, from the description, I know this thing will boost my alchemy abilities. Nice new alchemy set. And depending on my alchemy skill, uh, whatever I choose, that's the kind of alchemy set I will get. And then it takes it away. I almost forgot the coolest thing ever.
it makes a statue. Uh, more specifically, it makes a statue of you. And there you have it. Absolute genius. I love it. So, I think I have found my house, because this place is just incredible. Uh, I have absolutely no complaints about this house at all. I think it's everything I have been looking for. It fits with my uh, character's style. Um, I'm going to continue looking at and for other houses for my other character who's much more plain combat and just human in general. So, yes, as always, if you have any comments or uh, have any mods that you think I'd enjoy for houses, uh, leave them below in the comment section. I'll download them, check them out, film it all, tell you what I think. But as for this character, he's definitely found it. Have a good night, everybody.